away from that, Governor of Abia State, Alex Oti, says he's digitizing the civil service for efficient service delivery and productivity. He said this at the closing ceremony of the training of civil servants sponsored by the Foreign Commonwealth Development Office. Nena Gabriel reports. About 280 senior civil servants have been successfully trained on digital literacy. The civil service will benefit from the new skills acquired in terms of innovation. The focus is to have a holistic development of the state. As a government, we are focused on the holistic development of the entire state. Then we understand that the success and sustainability of our agenda is largely dependent on a robust civil service structure. One that is responsive, dynamic, and committed to driving the development programs of the administration. Basic digital training program design to bridge the digital skill gap and equip our civil servants with skills and knowledge to fit into the e-governance. For the trainees, the session was an eye-opener and would offer the state an accelerated development. The training was explosive, good and cool. And by God's grace, it will enhance our work as civil servants in Abia State. Applying the different packages we were taught during the training to aid the work of, uh, in my office. Earlier, the governor played host to the British High Commissioner in his office. That we're talking about digital governance, we're talking about digital skills, and the program that we're going on, Your Excellency, to talk about and uh, congratulate the graduates of that program. I think that's a nice example of where we can collaborate. I have we will also, of course, be open to discussing areas where uh, UK companies need to understand your business environment. The British High Commissioner also expressed his readiness to partner the state government in areas of trade, transportation and other areas of interest. Gabriel, TVC News, Unvosi, Abia State.